We're really concerned right now because uh, lamprey populations are in decline, you know, and so I feel like, you know, we're not living up to our end of the bargain in taking care of these fish. Lamprey were usually lumped in this category of other fish or, or trash fish. People didn't really understand the, uh, the uh, connection the tribes had with lamprey. And these fish play an important role, you know, and not just to, uh, to the ecosystem, but play an important role in our, in our, in our life and our culture. They're involved in our ceremonies at the Longhouse. They're considered one of our first foods. You know, they've always been part of our, uh, our heritage. And uh, we, we've made a promise that, um, you know, as long as they're around, we would, we would work to protect them. Lamprey were once very abundant in the entire Columbia Basin and tributaries of the Columbia Basin. Their uh, range extended all the way up into the headwaters of the Columbia, all the way in the upper Snake Basin. Now lamprey are only really present in, in the, in the mid-Columbia, and the lower Columbia River, and it's really tied to passage through the dams. So we're now forced to, to go to our only, our, our mainstay, our only, only place that we can really go is, is Willamette Falls to get any kind of numbers of lamprey. And we're down there harvesting for our community so we can have that reconnection with our, with our culture and our heritage and uh, the spirit of, of, of the lamprey. They're not going to return here to the Umatilla on their own. I've actually got to go down there and pick these fish out of a fishway and take them on the highway to get them up past these facilities. So it's, 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 it's frustrating in that aspect that uh, that's what we've come to. The whole idea of this is for Lamprey to come full circle. Not just the Umatilla River, but the Columbia Basin, and not just the Columbia Basin, their entire range. And we're getting those fish and we're placing them right in this prime spawning habitat. We're working to provide the passive structures for lamprey to be able to make it up over the system so eventually, you know, hopefully these fish can survive on their own and they don't need us going down to the main stem dam, you know, they'll be able to make those treks on their own. Improvements that we're making here in the Umatilla and improvements that other tribes are doing in other basins in the Columbia, you know, may not be things, you know, that uh, we get to see the benefit of, you know, in, in our lifetime. I'm working for generations after me. And hopefully my, my kids' kids or th their grandkids will be able to you know, harvest lamprey here in the Umatilla again at some point. We'll do what it takes to ensure the continued existence of, of this important species.